Hello guys, in this video, we're going to talk about how to create Google Forms with multiple pages. But before we begin, please hit that like button to show us your support and help our videos reach more people. Now let's get started. Google Forms can be used to redirect people to different pages, or we can show different pages depending on what the user chooses from the list of options. Access your Google Forms. Add a title to the form in the section. Write a short description of your form. Let's ask for the name of the person. Now let's ask a question relevant to the topic of our form. Choose a multiple choice option. Add the list of options for our question. When we use the multiple choice option, it allows a person to choose only one option. Now we need to link a new page for each option. From the section, Choose the last icon to add a new section. Add a title for this section. Let's name it according to the first option that we have created here. Add a question for this section, then add the options below. Now let's add our second section. If the section is on the top of the questions list, we can reorder sections. Click this icon, then drag this section to the end of the list. Now rename this section the same as this option, then add a question for this section. Now let's choose the checkboxes option for this question so that the user can select multiple answers. Now add all the relevant options here. Let's add our last section. For the title of this section, we're going to use the third option from this question. Now add a question for this section. Type in the question in this field and let's choose the checkbox grid. We want the user to select multiple answers. Now let's add a text, morning and afternoon, under the rows, and add the frequency under the columns. Let's click the preview icon and put the data here, and let's choose an option for this question. After we click next, we are redirected to the section for this option. It should redirect us to this section since we have chosen the second option. Now go back to the form. Choose more options. Select Go to Section based on Answer. Each of these options has a corresponding section. Let's choose the section the same as their name. Make sure we've linked the right section. Next, let's configure each section. You can see this text. After Section 2, it continues to the next section. Now let's choose to submit the form. Scroll down for Section 3. Choose to submit the form again. Now let's check the preview. As we choose this option, it redirected us to the section relevant to our chosen option here. So that's it for today's video. But before the video ends, here's something you shouldn't miss. If you need help to make courses and training, we have a marketing app that can help you create your own online courses that actually get sales. Create amazing courses with Udemy-grade customer experience. It includes profit and conversion boosting plugins. It integrates a popular payment system. It even supports video courses on any platform. It has a rich interaction with built-in comments, reviews, and questions. Create awesome courses. It would be easy for you to set up, and your students will love the user-friendly experience. Access dozens of ready-made templates for everything. Customize your course themes to make it feel unique with your branding. Students can resume course playback where they left it. So try Course Funnels now. Go to the URL getcoursefunnels.in. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video.